Hi there everybody, Ollie here, aka Secret Nimbus here, with what will be a brand new series, which is a look at the Drone Pack, which is a, uh, a mod, pa mod pack on the Feed the Beast launcher. If you use the uh, code DRONE, uh, it is a BE based mod pack, so uh, for those of you that have been watching the channel for a little while, know that I really like bees. Uh, I, 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 I always have to incorporate bees somewhere, if, if bees were available, gotta go for them, so an entire pack in revolving around bees was like, wow. Just gotta try this because um, I've been playing Material Energy Hypercubed, and the problem with kind of um, playing it as a series is that because it's being updated so frequently, it just breaks everything that you've done before. Like uh, a lot of the spatial I/O areas have been updated, so all, all the work that I've done before is basically obsolete, which is a pain in the ass. And um, so yeah, so basically. All the work I've like done before is basically going to be crap, basically. So I don't really feel as I want to continue on with it um, at this very moment. I may start again when it's kind of like a little bit more stable and then come back to it. I don't know. I'll see how it goes. But for now, I'm just going to try out this mod pack. Sorry, it's not textured. Um, I don't know if any of you prefer vanilla textures, but I actually hate them personally. So uh, because I'm kind of like still without internet at my house, um, it gets installed. It gets switched on tomorrow. So I'm looking forward to that. But I was only able, but I'm basically tethering all my internet to my unlimited tethering phone at the moment but it's kind of unreliable and I don't really want to spam it with too much data so uh, I'm looking forward to uh, getting some my proper fiber optic broadband and be able to start streaming and stuff like that which would be quite nice but for now we're just going to be playing with untextured just for the first episode it's only be like 15-20 minutes or so uh, and then hopefully from then on I should be using either Sfax or Sawtex depending on which one I prefer so uh, I really fancy mining some of those ores so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some wood uh, let's make some wood Make a crafting bench. There we go. Make a spruce. Is that like spruce coloured? I can't really tell. Uh, we'll plop you down. Let's make some tools. Um, oh, come on. There we go. Uh, and then we'll make a pickaxe and a shovel, I think. So, um, so yeah, this uh, mod pack is revolved around drones. And then also is a hardcore questing pack as well. So we do have quests, which is quite nice. Uh, is that a village over there? I can't really tell. Let's have a quick look. Let's see what it says. So, um, me metallurgy is a branch of... En Melitology is a branch of entomology concerning the scientific study of bees. Bees are wonderful creatures. Spend hours finding, breeding, and mutating bees. You can alter genes to make bee important to everyday tasks that you do not want to do. You can also take the natural route and spend countless hours breeding bees and perfecting them. What was this? Pick a study to practice with. This decision can only be one or other, so choose wisely. So, natural student or genetic student. That's pretty cool. So, uh, we've also got this as well. So, bees. Bees aren't just here to make honey. You can do so much more with them. Need a steady supply of oil. Uh, oil well a bee can do that so apiary and scoop okay so uh, and this is also gender -stry, so we need to make ourselves some uh, so while it's while it's got quests it also has uh, obviously we've got to do some mundane stuff like we've obviously got to go mining and things like that as well so we've got some coal here which is quite nice i still I still recognize my vanilla textures just about so i'm gonna grab some coal and some stone and stuff dig up a little bit and then make myself a shack for the for the night oh there's a there's a a2 volcano there's an AE2 meteor over there by the looks of things. Maybe. I don't know. I'll have to go have a look in a second. Um, that'd be quite nice if there's one nearby. I can see it just over there. If you can see in the top left-hand corner of the mini-map, there's a kind of um, what looks like a big black rock. And I think that's possibly... Is that Applied Energistics? Is this is this in this mod pack? Oops, Daisy. I didn't have if I you know, can't actually spell Applied. Um, yeah, Applied Energistics too. So it's probably... Oops, Daisy. Trying to get out of the uh, my inventory there. Um... Yeah, it's probably an Applied Energistics 2 uh, Meteor, which would be quite nice. I still really haven't played around with Applied, applied Energistics 2. Hoping to get there at some point with my Dark Trilogy uh, Dark Trilogy pack, which would be quite nice. But uh, but yeah, so I'm probably going to put um, Material Energy Hypercubed on indefinite hiatus for now, I think. So uh, unless it comes out with a stable version, which I might be able to carry on playing with, I'm going to give it a miss for now because i'm i'm more looking forward to oh got some tin here which i can't dig up until i've made a stone pickaxe i also need some iron assuming that that's possibly iron so let me craft myself a uh i like the double-sided hot bar I'm not sure how you get to that at the moment but uh it's huge and i really don't know how i'm supposed to get to it which is very bizarre um i have to look at what mod that comes from but uh let's make some more sticks and what we're also going to do is make ourselves a stone pickaxe marvelous so do 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 Let's dig you, let's uh, punch up my crafting bench so I don't leave it behind. There we go. I mean, I can still dig up things like coal with my with my wood one. 
put these up there we go just grab a little bit more need to make myself a an axe at some point so i can chop down some more trees would be a good idea there we go let's jump up here is that iron ore please say it's iron ore no it's copper ore um so we'll grab that grab you anyway i do need some iron ore i don't know where it's going to be but i do need some at some point but I, I will i will definitely need a supply of copper ore especially for like generating power and things like that so um that's coal ore. Is that iron ore? It looks more like copper ore again. So I really do need some iron ore at some point. It's not really that important for now. Go grab gra grab this tin for a second while we're at it. While we're chat while we're chatting. So so yeah, there's still tin around here. I think so. We will we'll have to we'll have to find some iron ore around here. I think iron ore is more brownie. So I think that stuff up there is probably copper ore as well. So we're just gonna have a snoop around see what we can find got some appetite up here up there in case you want to delve more into forestry later on i'm not sure i do or not but uh this is quite a nice starting area it's got a bit of everything really um which is quite cool uh got lots of trees got lots of um got lots of rocks nice nice lot of hills so where the hell is that meteor it's like over there it's like in that little cold dare bit. so i'm kind of sort of thinking of heading over there but i might stick in this area for now it's got Fair amount of like natural resources, which is quite nice. I'll head over there when I actually need it. I wonder if we've got sim we've got jetpacks in this mod pack. Let me have a quick look. Jetpack. Uh, we've got industrial craft jetpacks, which aren't the best. Put it that way. Which uh, we've got any other kind of jetpacks? I'm just thinking. Have we got? Let me think. I don't really want to build industrial craft jetpacks if I can get away with it. Personally, that uh, would be nice. Let me kill a sheep so I can actually sleep for the night as well. Would be a good idea. I know there's a couple over here, so sheep, give me your wool, wherever you are. Uh, that's water, so I'm going to need to murder some sheep, wherever they are. I'll whack them over the head with a wooden sp with a wooden spade, or just pick them to death. There we go, here's some sheep. I need at least three wool here. There's number one, there's number two, come on, number two, wherever it's gone. Number two, and where's number three? Come on, I need a sheep. Give me a sheep. Well, around here somewhere, I can see them on the minimap. Here we go, murder sheep. There we go. That, that that should be fine. So how the hell? Oh, it's gone into my hop. Oh, I see. So I think it's the top bar of my. Um, so I'm gonna need to make myself a little little shack for the night. I think. So let me dig in here. Come on, let me in. Then need to block myself up. There we go. So let me just block myself in. And what I'm gonna do is make myself some torches. Torches, quick. There we go. Can I put that right there? Excellent. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. Um, then what I'm going to do is uh, we'll dig a little bit further in. Let me find my crafting ta table. There we go. Put you down. And then I can make myself a bed uh, with some wood. There we go. One bed. Fantastic. Uh, I'm going to need to dig a little bit further in. A little more. And then we can sleep for the night, hopefully. So pop you down, sleep. There we go. So we're just gonna sleep, sleep for the night, get rid of all those horrible, horrible mobs, mobs even. There we go. Let's dig our way out of here as well. There we go, marvelous, fantastic. So uh, we're all good. We're all good for the, all good for a brand new day, which is nice. So we can uh, look about getting some more resources and then hopefully making ourselves a house at some point. Um, so yeah, I need to find some iron ore as well. I suppose would be quite useful. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll probably do some off-camera work. Like I said, this is a bit a bit ad hoc. I just kind of spotted it this morning. I was like, eh, I fancy recording an episode on it. Um, so yeah, I'll be looking for bees and stuff like that. So hopefully within the next um, like episode or two, I will start to actually do some stuff. <laughs> so oh, apparently I'm getting hungry. Do I have any food on me? No, I do not. Come here, piggies. You are going to be slaughtered for my uh, earthly means. There we go. So let's, let's make ourselves an axe. There we go. And let's make ourselves a sword. There we go. So let me chop you up. And then I'm going to go around slaughtering slaughtering pigs for their, for their delicious pork. Like so. Marvellous. Um, oh, we've also got cows up here as well. So I can slaughter you as well because you, you, you'll give me raw beef, which is fantastic. So... I need plenty of food. Here we go, marvelous. Going to uh, eat all of the food. I will. I will cook this up in a minute. Uh, apparently, I can't sprint because I have actually just like 
totally wiped out my hunger. She's not good. There we go. Got plenty of food now. Um, apparently there's an Enderman around here, which is not fun. So this is copper. We got more copper. Yeah, more copper. So I'm looking for iron still, really. I also need to really need to cook up some food real quick. So let me make myself. Where's my crafting bench? It's right there. Uh, pop you down, and then we can make a furnace. If I actually do that instead of compressed cobblestone, uh, much better. Plop you down, uh, and then what I'm going to do is just cook up some raw pork chops quick while I look around. Is there anything around here uh, worth mining up? Probably some more coal would be useful. Um, and then copper and stuff like that. Um, I will go caving, probably, um, between this and the next episode. So I'll, I'll make myself a mine, start digging stuff up, which should be quite nice. Get all the resources I need. Make myself like a little, a little shack or something to get going with. Don't know what kind of uh, base to build for this kind of mod pack. Uh, maybe like a giant apiary or something, like, something along those lines would be quite funny. Quite cool. If I can find the right kind of wood and stuff for it, it would be, would be nice. So, digging up some coal here. We'll grab some uh, copper and tin around. Don't know if I can make any... Can I make a copper pickaxe? Would that be better? I don't know, maybe. Let's uh, dig up some copper as well. Let's see if I can make myself a copper pickaxe. It would probably be better than stone, put it that way. I'm not sure if it will be able to dig up diamond or not, though, a copper pickaxe. If I can dig... If I can make one, that is. Bronze would be better. And there's obviously plenty of tin around, so uh, it would be easier to make bronze. There we go, grab some stuff. Let's go grab that those pork chops before I starve to death. There we go. Let's grab let's, let's get yourself some cooked pork chops. Wow, I've got to get used to this kind of double wide um double wide inventory. There we go, that'll do for now. Um and there's the last one, and then we can pick you up. So yeah, I need, I need to find a nice place to start my my home, I suppose. So it looks like a nice place really, I don't know. Uh, overlooking the uh, overlooking the forest would be quite cool. So I might build it around here somewhere. Ooh, there's a nice cave system for me to explore as well, which is quite cool nearby. So I might put my first house down around here somewhere. I've got a good source of food around here. Um, I've got access to everything I really need, like um, forests and stuff like that. So uh, let's just t let's just qu check the quest book real quick, make sure there's not anything I can do before rounding off the episode. So I'm going to make myself a scoop and an apiary figure out how to do that and a leadstone energy cell which is going to uh, require some power um what else we got uh, we've also then got practice as well so um pick a study to practice with so oop, i can hear zombies around here so i want to uh, kill you before you come and murder me murder more sheep why the hell not um so yeah i'm i'm probably gonna go down the genetic student so um task so how the hell do I do this one? Um, I need bedrock, apparently. I don't have any bedrock. So unless I get that from a quest, probably from one of these quests, actually. So um, you can do... So I'm going to need to start working through these quest lines, I think. So let me have a look at apiary. Uh, what am I going to need for that? Apparently, I can't craft it. Why can I not craft an apiary? Um, that's weird. Um, hmm, interesting. Why can't I make an apiary? Very bizarre. Um, I, I know how to make an apiary, I think. Um, I need like a scented scented pan... No, that's not right. Uh, I need uh, some wood. Hmm, it's interesting. Um, uh, let's try forestry. Am I looking at the right thing? Might be a, might be a little bit of a glitch in the, uh, in the first video, but... Hmm, interesting. What the hell's the apiary? Um... I mean, I can make an industrial apiary, but that's a bit uh, a bit past me. Yeah, it's not letting me look at any of the recipes for, uh, like, forestry stuff. Okay, I might have to look up the recipe for that. So uh, it's not, that, not exactly difficult uh, from what I remember. So I will look that up before the next episode. So this is just a quick introduction of what this mod pack is going to be about. A little bit of me blathering on about why I'm not going to be carrying on with material energy hypercubes. So uh, look out for the second episode of this later on in the week. Hopefully I will have done some prep work before then. Like I said, this was a bit last minute, a bit ad hoc. So I just wanted to do it more as an introductory episode of what this is going to be about. Murder, murder a cow. Come here, cow. There we go. Um, so, yeah, that's, uh, that's going to be the end of the episode for now. As always, guys, don't forget to comment and like if you've enjoyed the episode. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Apart from that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.